Glomnox here to play some faster than light. So where we left off, we had this uh, amazing ship with one hull. So uh, let's see how that goes. Let's go to the first nebula system. We got a flag on them ready. Let's get some uh, drives as well. Nothing happens, so let's socialize with the crew. So humanoid crew, have a word with your humanoid crew. Humanoid crew complains about all the injuries they have sustained, of course. Um, I wonder why we couldn't speak with Delanius. Our life support systems are coming slowly back online. Do this, can we? Yeah. Right, let's go to the next system. Whoa, that's fast. We have no fuel here. This is going to go so badly. See a small pirate station nearby, you can't be sure without sensors, but they might be preparing to board you. <laughs> and there are intruders on board. So we got our system there up and running. Um, let's get you over here and see what happens. Where are they are there. So let's air out this sector. And yeah, let's get him. You can as well. We need to take him out. Right. Uh, let's get you out immediately. There we go. And no more. Cool. That was fast. Close the systems up again. We are getting life support. We are not. Yeah, we are getting life support. Alright, let's go back. We have Trigo on weapons, Charlie on. Ryan on cockpit, and Charlie on engines. Alright. So let's go to the next one. We have the quest up here, so let's try and get to that one. <coughs> See if we can make it. Oh, no energy. Uh, rock armor transport nearby looks to have lost its bearings. <laughs> we are probably not going to attack it. Should we just try? What shield? It's so pathetic. We have to. Right, they have one weapon. Let's get the clone bay down and get a weapon online. And let's try and use this flag to take down their weapons. Let's see if something happens. And their weapon is what? Is that a missile launcher? I think that's a missile launcher. Please don't be a missile launcher. It fucking is a missile launcher. Alright, so. We might as well unpower this and get the shields up and get ready to die. Bam. Well, <laughs> that's what happens. Right, let's just go to the hangar and pick a new ship. So, we could just continue with this one and go for. I like the design of this one. So, let's. Yeah, let's do this one. Yes, cargo teleporter facilities facilitates buying and selling of trade goods at stores. Cool. Building material crates contain thousands of standardized structural rods used in deep space construction. The most boring shipment ever. Very basic trade goods. So it's probably just some starting um, credits when selling that. Right, we have a mantis and. Um, Sultan and two humans. Um, I think unless they have something to start with, we will move that Sultan into the shield. Let's socialize with the Sultan. The crew member suggest you recruit more NG since they are efficient and follow strict protocols. You have no Right, let's do something like this. So we are most likely always ensured to have... Oh, okay, let's do this. You, we are most likely always ensured to have some kind of shielding. You do one, uh, you fire a lot faster, 
So you do one normal damage, and so do you. Let's sell that ult later at first opportunity. And get through the sector alive. For once. Scans indicate that a fully 34 fully. At about 34 fully armored defense uh, turrets are stationed around this planet. Luckily for you, there is only one guy in this beacon. Alright, so it has missiles. Oh, let's take out the. Oh, it has fucking mind control. Please don't use it. Please don't use it. Yeah, there is. Alright, so they didn't power the mind control. Let's do this. There we go. Let's take out the shields. There we go. Let's just focus on one each. It's going pretty well. Three fuel, two missiles, and 14 scrap. Let's go to the next one. Let's just uh, try and go down here and see if we can find a store. Let us socialize with the crew because there is nothing happening. So let's try and speak with the humanoids. The human uh, crewman greets you formally. Captain, there is something I would like to discuss. You might not be aware of this, but parts of the uh, Family live in this system. I made contact, and so I stand by my oath. I will do my duty as long as you cry it. But with the rebels advancing here, I feel like I should be with my family. I formally request you to relieve me of my post. Well, so we can pick. The Federation prefers not to leave its own behind, but I understand the circumstances. Or you. Taking part in this mission is what we will protect your family. In the end, sorry, we can't do without you. So that is one of the humans. I'm a bit curious what will happen if we choose this one. So let's try and tell him he can do that. You locate your crew member's home planet, a busy trade world would lose ties to the Federation. Your crewman uh, should be able to lay low around here, but it is still unclear what will happen to this planet and its people. Dismiss your crewman. Uh, the ship touches down on a small landing pad. Your crewman's family is overjoyed by the unexpected return and you give a weapon and give you a weapon they managed to hide from the rebels. <laughs> so we got a weapon and some scrap for a crew member. That is a sucky deal. So some of our engines went. We got a anti-personal laser, so it does no damage. It pierces two shields and hits people. Plus 15 crew damage. Could be funny to try that. Although it does require us to unpower one of these guys, which is not viable right now. Let's go to the distress call and then the store. The distress signal is coming from a small space station orbiting an uninhabited planet, and their satellite defense system has gone haywire. And they're uh, we this will always damage us. Let's do it. Let's fire in the defense system. Hey, it worked. Buy a few volleys from a distance and it is clear the defense system is no match for your weapons. However, the station does not seem to be happy with your solution. You salvage what you can and jump before there is trouble. So we got a little bit out of it. So we have 40 scrap now. Let's go to the store, see if we can sell something and maybe even buy something. Alright, so we, a small a space mall sells good to ships coming and going from this settlement. So we can to quickly transport cargo and have a look at the goods. Let's do that. So we can sell the building material for 30 scrap. That's pretty nice. Let's do that. We can sell that. What? After some hackling, you reach an, reach an agreement. You prepare to teleport. That was not 30. That's 24. Scumbags. 
please cooper cooperate and sell the trade goods at the shop now, otherwise you disturb the balance in the universe. Alright, I was hoping we could buy something. Whoa. Heavy scatter drone, uh, hip heavy anti-drone, and hull repair. Repairs damage to your hull even faster. Part is consumed once it finishes. Uh, we can get a drone control probably. We can get some crew members, we can get a effector mark one. Does two iron damage. We can get an auto beam. Requires two power. Out of focus beam. Fast charging support beam designed to continue to keep enemy ships under fire. Adaptive focus beam. This requires one power. Newly developed weapon system that adjusts its beam pattern to enemy ships and gaining and gains 0 0.25. 25 damage each time it fires up to a maximum of 2. Huh. Let's try and sell. Oh, we just keep this. That's pretty cool. Let's. <laughs> we get nothing. Sell this and let's also sell this. Uh, these seemed a lot cooler. So we can buy. Auto beam or adaptive beam. This one is more expensive and it does charge up these. Supposedly for longer fights. So this does room damage and has a really quick charge time. And this one just does more damage. I really like this. It's 10 seconds. What are you? You are. Why are you so long all of a sudden? As compared to the other ones, I suppose. Um, let's have a look. You are 5 second charge time, so having that. Um, this one pairs in with our own guns. We get some fast firing weapons. It does require two power, which uh, that's a no-go. Let's take the one for 50 and buy some fuel. And say that is that. I really like the effector, even though it is always uh, also too Seems like a good combo. We get some scrap or every time we visit a store. Yeah, let's do that. So let's go to the next one. Let's see if we can find something good. Civilian Transport Hills Federation friendly. It's good to see you. We are on the way to the core systems. Cargo run. Do you have any news from the war? And let's ignore the ship. There's another store. Might as well do that. Let's go up. Should probably have done the store first now I think about it. You can see. There's a hacking system. I hate hacking systems. Let's focus. This has a drone bay. Let's just go for shields to start with, see what they are capable of. Let's hook down our oxygen. All right, it might, might be that we'll have to go for their weapons. Why are they firing? Uh, okay. We're firing. At the same time, and you miss. Of course, you miss. We got one weapon down. Let's go for the shields. Both weapons are down. There we go. One more. Let's go for the hacking drone. It's charging up its FTL. So let's go for the engines and the cockpit. 
There we go. Beautiful. 17 scrap and one fuel. Um, yeah, let's go into the nebula and then back to the store. Let's socialize with the crew and contact. How to talk with the sultans. Uh, if anything happens to them, it might be too late to apologize. Alright, let's go to the store. See if we can do anything here. Let's do the cargo transport and sell some building materials for 24 scrap. That's pretty cool. We get to keep it all the time, do we? Uh, we do. That is really, really good. We got missile drones. Would probably have been fun. Full power. Holy crap. That's that's a lot. This missile drone. That sounds really, really strong. So we can get a internal generator, autonomous generator that powers combat augments can also be used to activate a second combat augment during battle. This sounds really strong. If you just power a weapon. Powers co combat augments. But this is a combat augment. Oh, this is an augmentation. I suppose it's something to do with this. But we don't have any of that. What's this? Production augment. Um, yeah, I'm probably not going to play around with this and go for... We could go for the drone control and we could go for the mind control. In all honesty, this seems most powerful when you are doing boarding. Or if someone boards you, or if they have mind control and you can counter it, but in itself it doesn't seem that powerful. Um, yeah, let's go for the drum control. Yeah, let's do that. And buy up fuel for this one. Attack the pirate. Right, he has some kind of iron beam and a laser. So let's go for his weapon systems. He has a drone as well. So two defense drones to shoot down any projectile. Whoa. That's powerful. It's really powerful. Can we even do anything? It's not using his laser. It might just be that we'll have to... Let's try this. What can you do? Very small laser. It just fires a laser. Not really do anything with that. What if we do this? No. What if we fire slightly out of sync?
So we can trade four missiles for seven fuel, and I think that's a really good idea. And we can go down here and go to the exit. Reject our offer, and let's attack them. So they have a attack drone on us. Um, let's go for they have dual lasers. So let's go for their weapon systems. They also have a pipe beam. We just have to take down their weapons fast. Please don't miss all the time. Come on. There we go. Not enough assist. Damn. Wait, we got that down. That's good. Keep that down. There is fire here. We can hear it. So let's air out these systems. It's powering up FTL. So let's go for the shields and engines. Let's just go for it completely. There we go. Delayed. Go for shield. And we have it. There we go. Let's close the doors. Got some scrap. Let's wait a second. So who do you want to repair? I think our shield guy is probably... No, let's go for him. Having the cockpit up unless we go for automated maneuvering. I think it's good having the cockpit active at all times. Right. So let's go to the exit marker. A 21 fuel, that's really, really good. Found an abandoned long range relay, and you arrive at the beacon located in the civilian star system. A nearby colony contacts you. We've got a rogue rebel ship harassing the system. You have time to find it. Might as well. No idea where that is. So, right, let's go to the Spiker Om Omnicron. What is that? Right, let's use the basic engines. Travel at a minimum of two. No, standard in engines. Let's use two fuel. And by using that fuel, we gain. Um, apparently a head start of the rebels. So this somewhat isolated region was mostly untouched by the rebellion until now. In a peacetime it was a busy agricultural um, and production zone. The security situation has been deteriorating lately but you should be able to cross the sector without too much trouble. All right. Let's talk with uh, Crew, and let's talk with the humans. Terminal is broken. All right, so this is the system. I suppose we'll be heading uh, up here and then into the nebula. So I hope you enjoyed, it and I'll see you next time. Bye.